Hey guys, my name is Lockie. Welcome back to the Cusport Football YouTube channel, and we are back for a FIFA A-League career mode series. So excited to be bringing this back. Today, we are going to be taking the job at Brisbane Raw, a club who have struggled for the last couple of years in the A-League men competition. Can we turn things around for the Queensland club and bring back the glory days that we saw up in Brisbane from back in the early 2010s? Let's jump into it. First of all, as we can see here, decent budget compared to some of the other sides. Uh, as you can see there, City and Victory with pretty decent budgets uh, but Brisbane Raw with uh, just over 4 mil uh, we can hopefully work with that Coast Watch, Mr. Coast Watch taking over Brisbane Raw in another universe where Warren Moon was sacked after last season we're taking over. All right, first things first to check out the squad uh, that we have here, Brisbane Raw. And look, there's already some decent players, some decent young players that I, that I reckon we can keep a hold of and, and, and build up. Uh, players like Henry Hoare, he's just 22 years of age. Uh, Mel Yuznich has the pace on the wing. Jay O'Shea, key player for Brisbane Raw, 69 rated. Um, I'll probably look to change up the formation. I don't think I'll play the five at the back. Maybe go for 4-3-3, which is what Brisbane played back in the day during their championship years. But definitely some rebuilding to be done here, I think, at Brisbane Raw. There's some quality players that I reckon uh, we need to look at bringing in just to uh, strengthen the squad overall. But um, so far, th there's some decent stuff to work with, I reckon. And here we go. The first player that we're going to try and bring back to Brisbane Raw. His Brisbane Raw career ended prematurely. Charlie Austin, his time in Australia, uh, didn't work out in the end. He left the club uh, earlier than expected. Let's see if we can bring Charlie Austin back to the club. Uh, he's playing currently at Swindon Town in the lower league in England. Uh, it's 12 months remaining on his contract there. Let's see if we can uh, we can make a bid. Office looking very nice. Swindon managers come all the way to to uh, to Queensland to negotiate this one. Let's see if we can make a swap actually. I mean Skepovic. I wonder if we can swap out Skepovic. I feel like Charlie Austin might be just a little bit lower rated. But look, Charlie Austin, if we bring him to the club, is going to be the striker that we're going to want to play the most. So well, let's see if they'll uh, they'll accept it just a straight swap uh, with uh, Stefan Skepovic. Okay, they've knocked that back and they've uh, they've they've spotted Henry Hoare, talented young winger. We don't want to let Henry go. Uh, Henry's a fantastic player who we want to have involved in the club. Uh, instead of offering up Henry Hoare, I'm going to offer Carlo Armiento, good winger, and still at a decent age. Let's see if they take that plus 400k. Yes, all right, the deal is on. All right, and that wage looks pretty good. Charlie Austin is returning back to Brisbane Raw. Let's see how things can play out if. Uh, but Charlie Austin never left the club. Here we go. He's back. All right, we've got a big transfer offer here for Kai Truin, which is a big one. Uh, 21 years of age, 64 rated. He's not a player, but I don't think we want to get let go just yet. He's a key player for us. Uh, versatile as well, can play in midfield or in defense. Uh, we're going to knock back this one. An offer here for Jay O'Shea, the Irishman. Again, key player for us. We're going to we're gonna knock this one back as well. Here we go. Here's the one we've been looking for. And again, another really interesting one. Fulham. Premier League club Fulham have come in for an offer for Stefan Skepovic, the 32-year-old Serbian striker. We're going to accept this one. Uh, we don't admit it at the club anymore. We brought in Charlie Austin, so it's a big uh, win here for us, I think, in the transfer window. All right, we're doing a little bit of rebuilding here at the club at Brisbane Raw, so um, we're going to go ahead and search for players between the age of 16 and 23, so some young players playing in the A-League, see if we can pinch some talented youngsters from some rival clubs. Max Caputo is one we could pick up at uh, just 16 years of age, still just 11 months reigning on his contract. Botic could be one as well. Archie Goodwin, just 17 years of age, uh, could be a good long-term replacement for Charlie Austin. Alex Parsons, a former Brisbane Raw winger, potentially could bring him back to the club, maybe on loan. And then we're going to shortlist Patrick Wood, maybe not getting game time at Sydney FC, playing behind Adam LaFondra, so uh, we could uh, go ahead and make a move for Wood as well. Jed Drew, uh, a player that I'm excited about too, 18 years of age, fast winger. I think we're going to shortlist Dylan Perez too. He's just got so much pace, he'd be a, a great weapon to have at the club, especially with uh, the likes of uh, Robbie Cruz maybe getting a little bit older. And in defense, I think we're going to shortlist uh, Nectar Triantis, Central Coast Mariners uh, defender with a lot of potential. Six foot three, 19 years of age. So here's how our shortlist is looking for now. I think we'll try for maybe some loan deals for some of these players, see how they go. I reckon we'll start off by seeing if we can make a move here for Jed Drew. A lone move would be a good player to have as backup to uh, Henry Hall on the right wing. Dude, they want they wanted an 80-20 split. Let's bring that right down. I know his wage isn't much, but there we go, 60-40. Looks like we're making a move for Jed Drew. I think we do need some defensive cover too, so let's see if we can make a move here for Triantis. They won't go for the loan, so let's see if we can uh, pick up Triantis uh, from the Mariners. Uh, we'll see if we can offer Canardi. I don't think we're going to give Canardi much uh, game time. They've knocked it back, and they just want uh, 440000 with a 20% sell-on clause. Let's see if we can potentially bring that down a little bit. Let's go maybe three and a half. Bring the sell on clause maybe down to 10%. See if they're going to go for that. Up to 15. Let's take it. 
Triantis, let's go. Nectar, Triantis, arriving at the club. Here we go. Welcome to Brisbane Raw, son. And there we go, our Jedru loan move is confirmed, 12 months. All right, what we're going to do now is just have a search for Aussie players playing overseas. First of all, we're going to start with England, just to see if there's any players that could potentially bring back on loan or maybe on a, on a deal to give this, give them potentially some more game time down here in Australia. Uh, Luongo could be one we could look at. Interesting move, there you go, Aiden O'Neill, former Brisbane Raw midfielder, has uh, already made the move to England, now at Ipswich Town. I'll tell you what, we'll put Tom Rogic on the shortlist as well. Got an offer here for Brindle South. I don't think we're going to give him too much game time. We've still we've got Noah Smith is a backup fullback, so um, I think we're going to accept this one from Glory. All right, what moves do we want to make? I reckon Massimo Luongo could be a good one to bring in. Let's see if we can grab him on loan. Too short the contract. Perhaps Tom Rogic could be a good pickup as well. I'll tell you what, let's make a, make, let's make a move for Tom Rogic. Tom Rogic back to Australia would be a big one. Uh, let's again try that swap with uh, Marcel Canardi. I've turned that down, and they want a decent chunk of money that's a that's a large chunk of our transfer budget so that's pushing it for us i think we're gonna have to pass on tom rogic it's just like it's just too much of our transfer budget as cool as it would be to bring it back i don't think you can have it i reckon let's try luongo let's try mass luongo would be good to have him in defensive midfield partnering kai truen i reckon okay they're wanting 1.1 million which is much more doable let's try maybe 800 and see if they're cool with that Hopefully that should be all right. 800, 807, let's go. Massimo Luongo arriving at Brisbane Raw. A big signing for the club. The former Socceroo looking to uh, regain some form and potentially put, him, put himself back into our uh, soccer's contention. All right, so here's a recap of all the transfer moves that happened this window. First of all, we started off by bringing Charlie Austin to Brisbane Raw from Swindon Town. We made some loan moves here. Majok, Zabala is out, as is Waddingham and Nikolovsky, all making loan moves out. Then we brought in uh, Nectar Triantis for 350000 and then the loan move for Jed Drew. Skepovic was sent out to Fulham for a decent fee. And then finally, Mas Luongo and Brindle South, those two moves... Uh, on deadline day there, Mas Luongo, big signing for Brisbane Raw, defensive midfielder, uh, back in Australia, and Josh Brindle South, he's headed out to Perth Glory. All right, all the transfer moves are complete. It's time to get into the season, kicking off at the end of October here. We've got Adelaide United at home, big game. Uh, the Reds, and then away to Sydney SC, uh, home to the Bulls, and then away to victory. So a tough opening month of uh, of games there. All right, so here is how our squad is looking, heading into the first match of the season. Really solid lineup. I like it. So some new players straight into the starting 11. Massimo Luongo in defensive midfield. Good midfield setup there, I reckon. I mean, Luongo and Truin as the defensive midfield is providing some cover for Jay O'Shea, who we're going to have in that number 10 role. Charlie Austin, of course, playing up top. And then when we look at the bench, uh, we've brought in some players here. Of course, Jed Drew, who we can bring on, 78 pace, and then Nectar Triantis. It's a decent bench as well. We can bring on Robbie Cruz if we want something different. Uh, Jez Lofthouse has plenty of pace as well. Players arriving. Mr. Coastwatch, his first game in charge of Brisbane Raw. All right, we're underway. Brisbane Raw taking on Adelaide United in the opening fixture of the season. Good start here, keeping possession. I like it. Good build-up. That's Hingit on the overlap. Good chance here. Hingit. Austin, Charlie Austin. That's one of the big talking points for this season, man. How will it play out? Charlie Austin having now a full season of Brisbane Raw. Let's go. Got to block this cross, man. Shot from Adelaide. First shot of the game. Goes over the bar. Again, they go short. They're going for these short corners, Adelaide United. It's a set play from the training pitch, and it's the in. Not the ideal start. The training pitch move from the Reds. Ben Wallen scores. We just switched off here. It opened up for them. Oh, nice run from Hingit. Playing it short. Inside, great chance. Cutting it all the way back to Austin. Deflection. Corner at the end of the first half here. Charlie Austin, his first shot and goal. O'Shea's delivery. Can't get ahead on it. Almost half time. O'Shea's delivery again headed away. And that'll be half time. So we're down 1-0. All right, second half. Time to turn things around. We're going to keep some more possessions. Austin. Luongo. This is Kai Truen. This is good. Here we go, dude. We're building nicely. Can we find it? Here it is. Oh, almost. There's Kai Truen who made the run into the box. Good spell of possession here. Let's see if we can make it count. Truen for Austin. This is Charlie Austin. <laughs> How does he miss? Too much power on it. That's Robbie Cruz running through the middle. Let's see if we can find him. Here's Cruz. Back at Brisbane Raw, where he started his A-League career. Truen. O'Shea. 
O'Shea strikes. Another block. Adelaide have barely had a chance this whole second half, man. We've been much better. That's a great pass. Look at that to find Robbie Cruz. Coming forward here. The counter-attack is on. Jed Drew taken out. Not long remaining. Got to get the ball up the other end of the pitch here. That's not the pass that we want. <laughs> Terrible from Courtney Perkins. How have we missed that challenge? It's inside. That's a great save. Oh, my God. Dude, shocking defending corner for the Reds. Halloran goes back. Again, that set play. We don't want it to undo us again here. Oh, they're inside. No. Disaster. That's full time. Well, a big win for Adelaide on the road to open their season. But this is not the ideal start for the Raw 2-0 loss. All right, time to bounce back here against Sydney FC. Dude, that stadium actually looks kind of like their stadium. There you go. Party in the streets outside. <laughs> More Park. We're stuck with the same lineup. So Luongo starting in midfield. Austin starting once again up top. Back inside. Good opportunity. It's Luongo. Oh. Dude, I actually thought I was going in. <laughs> we can come straight back here. Elios niche. Forward. Chance Luongo. Two shots early on for Mass Luongo. Forward it comes. Can we get that run? It's Henry Hall making the run. Can we find him? There he is. Go Henry. <laughs> Go Henry. Great chance for Henry Hall. Oh, Redmayne again. Let's see if we can break forward again here. Good chance. Lawongo in behind. Miliuznic. Oh, off the post. Great opportunity for Brisbane. That should be half time. And it is indeed nil all. But man, we've definitely been the better of the two sides. Look at the shot stats there, man. Six shots to one. Chance for Sydney. Lafondra. Good save. It is near post, Holmes. Sydney. Just like Adelaide. Playing it back. Inside the box. That's another great save. Holmes is keeping us in this game now. This is Austin. Wide for Meliuznic. Good play. That's Luongo. Luongo! Let's go! Brisbane Raw. Hit the front. And he's deserved a goal with his fantastic play this match. Mass Luongo, the former soccer who back in Australia. First goal for the season. Let's make those final substitutions. Lofthouse on. Jed Drew on. We'll bring on Robbie Cruz. It's been a heroic performance from Brisbane Raw. This is Lofthouse. Cruz. Cruz, oh, off the crossbar, and in, own goal, Robbie Cruz is celebrating, but it'll be a Jack Rodwell own goal, it's 2-0, Jack Rodwell with a own goal, falling the Robbie Cruz strike, and we win 2-0, a huge response after losing at home in the first game. All right, next up, we've got Brisbane Raw, MacArthur FC, let's go, sticking with the same lineup again, so still no changes. But I'm liking this lineup and how it's looking. Luongo's been good so far. Romero for MacArthur. Ball's on the attack here. Chance. Ulysses De Villa. Warring signs early here. De Villa, just that little pocket of space, dude. How do we leave that space so vacant? Daniel Azada coming forward. Well done, Hingit. So Shane making the run. This is a really nice play. Back inside for Austin. Charlie Austin. That's a really good save by Philip Curto. Delivering strike. Still on there. Cleared away now. Daniel Arzani down the left here. Good challenge. He can get so far. Doing well against Arzani. MacArthur coming forward again here. That's a really nice pass. Well done, Holmes. We brought him out quickly. It's still on for the pulse. Oh my goodness, what a goal. We just couldn't deal with it. It was just comical. Romero scores for MacArthur. We're down 2-0 in the first half. This is not good. Ingit again does well to hold off Arzani. He's winning that duel so far, Jack Ingit. Well done, son. Shots. 3-3. Three to three. Possession very even. Craig Noon on the wing. Inside for Devia. Oh, Devia still going. Oh, this is ridiculous now. Oh, man. It, dude, he just got past Tom Aldred way too easily there. We're going to turn this around. Forward for O'Shea. Has he got the pace to go all the way? Jay O'Shea. Surely. Great save, Curdo. J. O'Shea for Austin. Off the post. Follow up. Saved again by Curto, who's having a blinder of a game. Oh, MacArthur are going to get away here on the counter. It's De Villa. Let's bring him down. Oh, Jack Hingit there to save the day again. The defense has been shocking today, aside from Jack Hingit, who's been everywhere. We need to give our fans something to celebrate about. Here we go. Over the top. Charlie Austin, surely. Team effort. Two home losses to start the season for Brisbane. It's not what we wanted. Seven shots to Brisbane, six to the Bulls. Got to do that post-match interview. Never looked like scoring today. I disagree. I disagree. Excuse me. 
Have some respect. The Newcastle Jets on top with two wins, two draws. City in victory. Wellington Phoenix, Western, and Adelaide United. So all three Melbourne sides in the top six at the moment early on. Uh, when we look, have a look at the bottom of the ladder, Sydney FC, who we defeated in the second round. Uh, then Mariners, MacArthur, uh, Perth Glory yet to win this season. And currently sitting second bottom. Thanks so much for checking out this first episode of the Brisbane Raw Career Mode series. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel to keep up with future episodes of the Brisbane Raw Career Mode series coming out real soon. My name is Lockie. This is the Coastwood Football YouTube channel. See you guys in the next one.